everyone welcome to my channel wonderfully made thank you so much for stopping by my channel I really appreciate it today I have for you a get ready with me video um, using all of the products that I recently hauled. so this is my black owned makeup brands get ready with me this is a really popular video right now and of course I wanted to join in on the fun even though this type of video seems to be a bit popular right now there are several youtubers out there who have pretty much been doing these types of videos for some time now um, and I will try to link their information below um, I know that Jackie Ina I think is how you pronounce her name every year around black history month she does these types of videos um, there's another youtuber and I'm so sorry I can't remember her name but I will link her videos or her uh, channel below she has been promoting the use of black owned makeup brands you know I want to say I first saw her videos or I first started watching her videos maybe two years ago one or two years ago and she started doing this so um, it's not new even though it is popular now but anyway I do want to encourage everybody out there to just get on YouTube and type in get ready with me black owned makeup brands or bomb I think that's the acronym that they're using BOMB and check out some of the youtubers out there who are you know getting involved with this tag so I'm going to stop rambling in a second and get to the video but I do want to say to you guys thank you so much for stopping by my channel I really really appreciate your support to any of you who may have stumbled upon my channel for the first time welcome I really really appreciate you taking the time to spend a few minutes of your day with me and I am gonna ask you to hit that subscribe button so that you can keep up with what I have going on on this channel I am gonna list all of the products that I used for this makeup look in the description bar below the only item that I use that's not owned by a black makeup brand or a black owned makeup brand is max fix plus I use that to set all of my makeup everything else is from black owned makeup lines including my primer and moisturizer and all of that good stuff so this is the look that I came up with and if you want to see how I created this look then stay tuned but as always remember that you are fearfully and wonderfully made by God and he loves you and I'll see you in the next video so I'm starting off with the true tone moisturizer which has an SPF of 15 by fashion fair I then go in with the Iman time control undercover agent all control primer and I have to say that I have been loving both of these products and then I take that same concealer trio and I use the yellow shade as an eyeshadow primer. So here I'm taking my Fashion Fair pressed powder in toffee caramel and I'm just using that to set the concealer on my eyes. Now I'm moving on to my eyeshadow look and as you can see I am using the Color Dazzle eyeshadow palette by Fashion Fair. Now this eyeshadow palette has pretty colorful eyeshadows in it and I was trying to go for more of a neutral look and I really liked the way it came out. The shadows um, blended very well, they were very pigmented and I really like this eyeshadow palette.
So now it's time for me to apply my foundation and I'm using my Fashion Fair Perfect Finish Cream Makeup in the shade Butterscotch. And yeah, this foundation is life. I absolutely love it. If you have dry skin especially, you will love this foundation. Now they do have a cream to powder, but I wanted something that was more um, moisturizing and had more of a dewy finish and this foundation did not disappoint. Now it's time for concealer and I went in with my Iman Correct and Cover Skin Tone Evener Powder to Cream Concealer. Yes, you heard me correctly, powder to cream. I have never seen a concealer like this before. It's very unique. I mean, it's a powder, but once it hits your skin and it warms up, it turns into a cream. I love this concealer. I have been using it just about every day. The coverage is medium to full. It's very buildable. It did not crease on me once I set it, and I absolutely love it. So now I am setting my concealer with my Fashion Fair Oil Control Pressed Powder in Sugar and it's basically a translucent powder. It comes off a little bit ashy but I make it work at the end but it absolutely holds my concealer in place. Now I'm going to do a little bit of contouring using my Luxury Contour Trio by Iman Cosmetics and I have to say that this contour shade is a beautiful um, color. However, oh my goodness, you have to use a very light hand when using this um, contour trio because a little bit goes a long way. And I did find it to be a little bit difficult to blend out. So now that I've finished my eye look, I am going to go in with this Kajal Eyeliner by Black Radiance. Um, I recently learned that Black Radiance is not a black owned makeup brand, but I didn't know that at the time that I purchased the eyeliner. And so now I'm finishing my eye look with a mascara by Iman, and it is the Volumize Mascara. I really love this mascara. I have been wearing it every day since I purchased it. It's an excellent mascara. I will definitely be repurchasing this mascara. So now I am setting my foundation with my pressed powder in the shade Toffee Caramel by Fashion Fair. Here I'm going to use my Iman Cosmetics Sheer Finish Bronzing Powder in the shade Afterglow. Um, it doesn't really work for me as a bronzer, but as a blush, it works very well. And as you can see, it's very pigmented. Um, now I'm going to do a little bit of highlighting using my highlighter in the shade Golden Lights by Fashion Fair. So here I'm just going to complete the look finally <laughs> and I'm going in with my lip liner by Iman Cosmetics in the shade Fuchsia and then I topped that with my Fashion Fair Lip Teaser Matte Lip Cream. That's a mouthful in the shade Lace. Now I will say that the color that I achieved with this combination really wasn't what I was going for but at the end of the day I liked the way it came out and I liked my overall look so that's all I have thank you guys so much again for stopping by my channel and I'll see you in the next video